Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to Ducks Pokemon. My name's Zach, but you can just call me Ducky. And in today's video, we got two things going on. We got an opening, and we have a mail day. We'll do the mail day first, the opening second. But before we do any of those things, I need to remind you about our 350 subscriber giveaway. Yes, you heard that right. You're thinking to yourself, what? I thought it was 300. No, it is 350 now, because I added more to sweeten the pot. So, there's gonna be four winners of this giveaway. I've already said all the details in the giveaway video i'm going to put that down below in the description but anyways you guys can go uh enter that giveaway you have to like comment subscribe and share oh uh, you know you guys already do that anyways but you're gonna have to do three things and then you'll get entered you can also check out my instagram at octoducks pokemon if you want to get in over there if you're new to the channel and you've come here from the giveaway welcome to the duck squad as i like to call it we are super fun we are trying to be positive as much as we can and we love to open Pokemon cards. All right, with all that out of the way, we are going to get to our mail day. This is from Pokey Mart Collectibles. I can't really show the envelope because it has my address, but like, here's the envelope. But I got two cards from him totaling $10.50, which is, you know, a little pricey for two cards, but they were two cards I really, really wanted. So here we are. All right. Ooh, packaged very, very nicely. I've purchased from Pokey Mart Collectibles before. I got a, um, a pack of XY base set from him a while back. Oh my gosh, it's in another envelope. Look at this. It's an envelope in an envelope. That is awesome. And here are the main events. Yeah, I totally forgot <laughs> what I bought. And then I was like, oh wait. Yeah, so here we are. Oh, it's in a little team bag as well. Let us open this up and see what we have. Did it come in one top loader, two top loaders? It looks like one, which is, you know, that's fine. I'll take that. But also, hold on. Check out Pokemart Collectibles. I already have one of these because, you know, I already bought from him. But here it is, Pokemart Collectibles. Super awesome guy to work with. I'm going to leave this down here. Super awesome guy to work with. He actually was very nice about it. He knew that I was a return customer and all of that. And so here we are. Uh getting two cards that I really, 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 really wanted. The first of which is this full art Hoopa EX from Ancient Origins. This card is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I had to have it. It was under TCG player market price. And so I said to myself, Ducky, you only live once. Get that full art Hoopa EX. Probably one of my favorite cards in my collection now. Uh, even though I'm not a huge fan of Hoopa, look at the colors on this thing. Almost as amazing as my, you know, little full art Xerneas over there, but not as good. You know, this is just, it's it's really nice. <laughs> and next, the card that I have been complaining about for the past two months, full art Surfetch V from Vivid Voltage. I have been trying to pull this card with all of my power, but I cannot do it, so I bought it. And I know it's like, Ducky, what the heck, you're caving in, and it's like, I'm sick of trying to hunt for this card. And so here we are, full art Surfetch V. Uh, I'll put the Hoopa right over here. And the Surfetch is going to be our pull of the day. Look at this. It's Surfetch. It's Surfetch. Y'all, if you guys have been following the channel for a bit, you guys know that my third favorite Pokemon of all time, mm, probably close to second right now, is Surfetch. Just look at him. He's so cool. He's so cool. All right. And besides that, we have a little quick, quick story time. I bought some stuff on Target, and I bought the Sylveon GX uh, Evolution Celebration tin. They used to be $10 on Black Friday. Not anymore. And so I bought it for $20. Still fine. There's Evolutions, I think, in there, and I think there's Burning Shadows as well. Came back. It was the wrong tin. It was this Leafeon tin. And so I went to Target today, actually, and I went to the counter, and I was like, look, I, I got the wrong tin. I know it's out of stock. What are my options here? And they basically said, sorry, dude, can't do anything for you. Like, they couldn't even return it for me. Whatever. That's fine. I'll keep the tin. It's the same packs in here anyways, so why not? We'll just open the tin. I think I've already opened this on the channel, but we're going to do it again because it's a nice tin. So... Without further ado, let's do that. Let's do that. I went to Target today and Meyer. Today is Friday. I usually record on Fridays, and I go out and do my hauls on Fridays, even though that might change. Uh, so I, I did my, you know, my daily haul or my weekly haul on Friday, and Meyer had zero cards, zero packs. I'm sorry. They have trainers toolkits everywhere. Like it is so easy to find a trainers toolkit. Honestly, even at Target, here's the 
little leafy on GX promo. Oh. Okay. <laughs> can you just... Oh my gosh, can you just stay? Stay! <laughs> Even at Target, there were like zero packs. And I literally mean zero packs. Not a tin. There was only... Yeah, this is good. Uh, there was only... Trainer's Toolkits. And... I think a couple of those, uh, Zamazenta Zashian theme decks, and that was it. All right, look at these packs. We only got four packs today. It's a classic ducky opening, if you will, but that's okay, because they're pretty good packs. We've got Crimson Invasion, which is meh. We've got Burning Shadows, which is really, really good. Sun and Moon base set, you all know what I feel about Sun and Moon base set. And Evolutions! Yeah, I'll take those. That is why I bought the Sylveon GX at full price. I'll, I'll take the, the Leafeon GX at, you know, full price as well. Because these packs, you know, this is like literally a $15 pack. So it pays for half of it if I get a good pull. So the way we're going to be doing this is Sun and Moon, Crimson Invasion, Burning Shadows, and Evolutions. Are we ending tonight on up Tonight? Ending this video on Evolutions? No, I think we're going to end it on Burning Shadows because I like Burning Shadows a little bit more. Alright, if you've gotten to this point of the video, if you want an entry in the giveaway, on this video, you have to like, you have to be subscribed, of course, but on this video, I want you to comment Solgaleo, okay? And if you do that, I will enter you into the free giveaway, it is 100% free, you can win Hidden Fates, you can win a bunch of Ultra Rare cards, you can win so much. So, you know, if you're at this point in the video and you're not skip, 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 skip skipping, like I usually do when I watch YouTube videos... If you're not totally skipping everything, please comment Solgaleo down below or something with Solgaleo in it. I don't judge. You know, whatever it is. And I'll enter you into the giveaway. Even if you've already entered on the giveaway post, I'll give you an additional entry. Because I'm just that excited. Here we go. We got ourselves a Psychic Energy. A big Malasada. It's a Breon. Y'all know I do not like Breon. I do not like Breon. We got a Krakorok. A Snubble. A Fero. A Grubbin, a Spiro, <laughs> and a Lolan Grimer, a Reverse Hollow Rare, because I'm the king of Reverse Hollow Rares. Crabominable, and a Rare is a non holographic Hariyama. All right, starting things off with a Reverse Hollow Rare, because I'm the king. Y'all know that. I pull so many Reverse Hollow Rares, which isn't bad. So we're, I want to say one half for one, but like that's not really a thing. We're, we're 0 for 1 right now. Time for Crimson Invasion. Honestly, I, I've slandered Crimson Invasion so much over these past, you know, how many years I've been on YouTube, how long Crimson Invasion's been out. It's been out since 2017, yeah. So I've, for the past three years, I've slandered Crimson Invasion, but honestly, you can get some pretty good pulls. I, I, I'm thinking about that Gyarados GX Full Art in particular. That's like a really nice card, so, you know, if we pull that, I'd be pretty happy. Pilo Swine, Devoured Field. Zwilius, Houndor, Spoink, Mischievous, a Pikachu, a Chimeco, a Reverse Hollow Aeron, and our rare is a Holographic Beware, and our rare is a Holographic Beware. Kind of rhymes-ish. Fun! Okay, so we're like batting, now we're batting one half for two, because I call, I call those hollows half point hitters. They don't really count. You can get a hollow anywhere. They're worth like 25 cents, you know. Time for evolutions. Time for evolutions. Get excited. Get excited, everybody. It's evolutions time. I've pulled two reverse holo Charizards. I have yet to pull the holographic Charizard. So, if today we pull this holographic Charizard, I don't even know. I don't even know what I would do. I would be so freaking happy. This is probably not a good pack to keep. I like to keep as many pack arts as I can, but that just well, it did not look like a good pack art to keep. Here's your code card, 1, 2, and done. Maybe we won't get a dud pack out of this Evolutions pack. 3 to the front, not 4. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Almost did that. Almost made that mistake. We've got ourselves a Magmar, a Venusaur Spirit Link, a Metapod, a Sandshrew, a Ponyta, a Magnemite, a Pikachu, a Machop, a Reverse Holo Rare, because I'm the king of Reverse Holo Rares, Machamp, and our Rare. Oh. The worst card you could possibly pull from Evolutions! Starmie. I was gonna put it in, like, the regular reverse category. It's that bad. But this Machamp, kinda sick, not gonna lie. 
So we got ourselves a reverse hollow rare Machamp. So that's two reverse hollow rares. No ultra rares yet. So it all comes down to this last pack of Burning Shadows. If you're new to the channel, I'm going to do a little ritual with you. If you're if you're already, you know, from the channel for a, mo for a while, you all know the drill. Ready? I'm going to send you all the good vibes. Ready? All the good vibes have been sent to you, the Duck Squad. In return, all I ask is that you give me the good luck. There are three ways you can give me good luck. Number one, like this video. Number two, comment on this video. If you want the entry, comment that thing that I said earlier. Comment that thing. I, I'm not going to tell you what it is because you got to be watching the video, but... If you want that entry into the giveaway, you have to comment down below the word that I told you to. And number three, if you're not already subscribed, please consider clicking that subscribe button. If you're already subscribed, click that notification bell to be notified every time I post Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. With all that being said, let's open up the last pack. It is Burning Shadows. It's got a, like a print line running down the middle of the pack. That's unique. I don't know if you- I, I'm not gonna be able- Oh, yeah, I can't get get that on camera. Look at that. Right down the middle of the pack, there's a print line. That just means that they packed it extra tight with ultra-rare goodness. Alright, here we go. I'm not looking at the code card's reflection, because, yes, that is a thing you can do. And here's your code card. One, two, and done. Alright. Four to the front. Let's get ourselves something awesome, amazing. Duck Squad, let's do it. We got ourselves a Psychic Energy, a Heat More, a Weakness Policy, a Potown, a Sneasel, a Venipede, a Horsey, a Cutify, a Ladybug. Why are we pulling my least favorite cards? Okay, it's a Reverse Hollow Rare because I'm the King of Reverse Hollow Rares. Whatever. Worst card. Worst Pokemon ever. I hate Bruxish. Ugh. And the final rare of this video is a holographic dark guy. So Bruxish really came in clutch here and, and destroyed this opening. Three out of the four packs had reverse hollow rares. That's that's pretty gnarly if I, you know, if I say, so, if I can, if, uh, uh, what am I saying? It's pretty gnarly. It's pretty gnarly. If I do say so myself is what I was trying to say. But nothing dethroned that beautiful full art surfetch that, oh god, that gorgeous artwork of Hoopa EX. And of course, we got that Levy on GX. Meh, meh, meh. I mean, is is it worth doing a recap? Yeah, we'll do a little bit of a recap. So we got six rares, or yeah, one, two, three, four, five, and then a regular rare. We got two holographics, which is okay, I guess. I mean, not the biggest fan. Three reverse holographics. I Brock, Brock's just just get out of here. I think our poll today is this reverse holo rare Machop, because if you grade evolutions reverse rares or reverse hollows in general at PSA, and you get a ten out of these. They're worth a lot, but I'm not going to grade them. Anyways, that is just about going to do it for the video today. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Always, always, always do those things. Makes me happy. Hopefully my videos make you just a little bit happier. Remember to enter that free giveaway for my 350 subscribers. It ends once I hit 350 subscribers. We're sitting at 307 right now. So, you know, we just need 43 people to subscribe, which is very attainable. Very attainable. So make sure to tell your friends, tell your family. Subscribe to Octuck's Pokemon so I can win a giveaway. With all that being said, I'm Octuck's Pokemon, and I'm out.